So the, the terminated projects, there were three. Uh, one was focused on the, the U.S. Coast Guard, and one was focused on uh, New London, Connecticut, and the third was focused on the Port of Providence. To help answer the questions that those communities were trying to answer about their coastal hazard risks. CHAMP stands for the Coastal Hazards Analysis Modeling and Prediction System that helps decision makers quickly understand what's at risk from a given event. So we're delivering both high resolution, very local scale, tailored forecasts for storm surge and wind, but we're also delivering online dashboard that identifies the things that are people ought to be worried about. So it's not just looking at a map of flooding and having to remember what specific things are in harm's way. Those things get highlighted in our system. Um, the generators, the electrical transformers, the server rooms, the structures. We're still hopeful that DHS will fund the completion of our Coast Guard demonstration project. And we don't want to lose that momentum. You know, when, we, when we're not able to fund individuals to continue working on these projects, even when we find new funding, we, we're, we could be looking at six months or more just to bring a new person in.